you who are live streaming with us from our beautiful edifice here at 985 53rd Street in the city of Oakland, California, right on the edge of Emeryville, California. We have been blessed by the Lord God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob just to be in the land of the living and to see another Sabbath day. Do you realize that Thanksgiving seemingly was just yesterday, but it has come and it's gone? Do you realize that Christmas has come and gone? Do you realize it was just the other day that there was New Year's in 2020, December 31st, and then the following day was January the 1st, 2021, but both have come and they're gone. Time is winding up, and I'm telling you, this is the right time now. If you have not been going to church, if you have not been getting close to God right now, is the time to get close and to start following what he says. No, no, don't let the devil give you that lazy spirit. And don't bring that 2020 lazy spirit into 2021. He's giving you a new day. God gives us days, months, years, hours, seconds to get it right. So don't use any excuse. I'm looking. No, you look and find. God will guide you to where you're supposed to be. And if you listen carefully, you'll be praying as you should. You'll be reading your Bible as you should. And God requires him to be first in your life. Listen to the scripture here in Exodus, the 20th chapter and verses one through three. And God spake all these words saying, I am the Lord your God which have brought you out of the land of Egypt, out of the house of bondage. Thou shalt have no other gods before me. That tells me right there, God want to be first in your life. When you were in trouble, you may have not prayed like you're supposed to, but he got you out. And when you are troubled in mind, who brings relief to your mind? Or you may say the doctor, the medicine, or but if God don't regulate your mind, if God don't bring peace in your heart, uh, you won't have peace. And the reason why you're troubled is because if you're not with him, he will trouble your spirit. He will not let you rest. Because your soul, he loves your soul. He loved you. He loved you so much until he sent his only begotten son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross for our sins. I'm just going to leave it there. And I want to say start off right. If you start off right, you'll end right. You can't, uh, from California, get on the freeway going toward Maine or uh, New York, going south or north, you have to go east. You have to go east. So that that's the way God's plan is, is through Christ Jesus, putting him first. And then watch your life be successful. Watch, your, watch this year, you will have joy and peace. I'm done. I'm done. We're going to talk about the rules for Christian living. We need rules and guidance in life. I don't care if on your job, in school, wherever you go, even in your own home, you have rules for living in that house. So does God in this world. God bless you.